From Star SVP, we're proud to offer you their all new D lights. They're their ultra low profile micro stars. They're available in two profiles depending on how much light you need to blast from the outside or inside of your service vehicle. Here is the MicroStar in the 6 LED format. It's available in five conventional safety colors and splits. So in solid, all six diodes will flash away just in that. And in a split, for an example, a blue and amber, three by three. So it's an old school light head, solid colors and split colors. On this side is the D-Light 3. Three LEDs, putting this half the size. And don't let the little size fool you, because when you turn this on into your 12 volt switch, and they also work all the way up to 30 volts, this is the intensity that you're going to get. The nice thing with these light heads, it's something that I like when it comes to durability and DOT vehicles, is they're assembled with a die cast backing, a polycarbonate fluted front lens to help take the light and disperse it outwards at 50 degrees, and the back for that enhanced durability die cast aluminum with a black finish. So this is all you have when it comes to the MicroStar light heads. There's no additional bezels, find an appropriate spot, center hole here, two for the sides, add on the backing, which is a thin foam piece. Black screws are included, so it blends right into its surface, and there you'll have it. 12 flash patterns are available within these lights, and they have phasing between one and two. So that's how you're going to set the flash pattern and it's syncing. So phase one and phase two, that'll be your alternating. If they're on the same phases, simultaneous, that's how the flash patterns will work. The light heads have a Gore-Tex breather on the back. So that's what this little gray dot is here give you a look on the backside of this guy, as he is actually without the Gore-Tex breather. So difference between the two, when you have this mounted horizontally, Gore-Tex breather will obviously be just fine like this. But if you have the light heads turned, so they are going in a vertical manner, and that's just fine to do with them, you'll want to make sure that that breather is downward facing. Flash patterns. When the light heads are on and blasting away with their lighting, and in the solid, 12 flash patterns. 12 flash patterns in the split, so everything will have a nice appropriate color. You're not going to have any where there's too many patterns and blurring the different colors together. So very simple. Green, that is going to be your pattern change. When that is momentarily applied to a ground source, yes, a ground source, not a positive, that'll make the flash pattern change. You can preset them before you make your final connections, or if you wanna do this on the fly, like I'm doing here on demonstration, a momentary switch tied into a ground. White trigger wire, that is what STAR refers to as the S-Link. So that is how the MicroStars will talk to themselves. So you can have the six diodes working with each other. They'll also talk to the three diodes. So depending on your vehicle and how you want to have everything arranged around them, these little guys can talk with these guys. So thinking of a nice placement for a vehicle equipped with a push bumper or grill guard. The six diodes, forward facing, appropriate colors and synchronized, and then on the sides, horizontal or vertical, that's where these little guys can come into play. So over here, blasting into the intersection and plenty of forward facing coverage. Great little light heads, aren't they? So again, from our friends at Star SVP, the D-Light MicroStars.